lot of people want to do that. And part of getting healthy is about eating healthy. You have to do the hard work and getting processed foods out of your diet. For more about where to start, we have some help. We have Lisa Miss Levy here. Did I pronounce that correctly? Yes, you did. did. Okay. You got it. And she is with uh, she is an integrated dietitian. Correct. correct? She's with Beaumont Health. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. I appreciate you. it. And you have a really cool dish you're going to make for us. Tell us about it. Yeah. Well, the biggest thing that I hear from my patients is that they need something fast, but healthy that falls within the parameters of what I'm asking them to do. And this fulfills that. And it does. It's something you can buy almost everywhere. So I brought the package. Um, and if you don't find this in the freezer section, you can get it almost at any other store in another brand. And this is just a cauliflower medley, so people know. But right. it really, a lot of people are referring to it as cauliflower rice. Exactly. Right? Right? Exactly. Yep. So every brand is going to call it something different. Okay. But the idea is that it's frozen and it's ready to go. So ready you just throw go. it in the pan. Okay. So yep. tell us and you spice it up a little bit though. Yeah. So there's a recipe right on the back of this and it tells you what to do. And so I just kind of, you know, do my own version of it if I want to. But basically you're heating this up in a pan. I put some coconut oil in okay. here because it tolerates the heat better and mm -hmm. I want I want a stable um, fat that I'm going to put in. And just so people know, there are, there are some peas and maybe some carrots. In yep. There. Peas, like. carrots, and a few scallions are in here. Okay. So it's all healthy, lots of good vegetables. And then it calls for some uh, garlic, soy sauce, and mm. you can use any kind of soy sauce that fits your diet needs, and a little bit of ginger. Ooh. So I put that in there. That's the good stuff. Yep, and then you just stir that up and you let it get hot. And then once that is warm, you scramble, it calls for one egg. I put two because we're four people in our yeah. family. You can do whatever you okay, want. Great. Yep, so you just scramble your eggs, you put them in there, and then they just start cooking and it's done in five or seven minutes. Ah, so this is what makes it more of the, like a fried rice. Yeah, exactly. Like an Asian fried rice. Right, you, you get the taste, the flavor, but you're getting protein, you're getting a healthy fat from the coconut oil, and you've got lots of vegetables, and you're omitting the carbs, which gets a lot of us into trouble. I mean, this is all the rage, and there's so much you can do, it seems like, with cauliflower. I've seen so many different recipes. You right. Can, you can mash it, you can make it kind of like a, a mashed potatoes exactly. sort of feel. And I was talking to knew about this earlier I said I mean does it really feel like you're eating rice? She said, kind of. Psycholo yeah. Psychologically, it does feel right. like you're, you're Right, and you can it. keep shoveling it in, and it's really okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. I haven't <laughs> tried it, so I'm like, I am I am completely fascinated by this uh, concept. Tell yeah. people a little bit more about healthy eating, though. How, how do you define it? So healthy eating, and really what I wanted to talk about was clean eating, because it's a new buzzword, and I think people are a little bit confused, and they feel like it means fancy cooking, mm -hmm. or something unattainable that they have to learn about, but it really means coming back down to the basics of what's healthy. Um, you want to eat food that looks like it grew from the earth. Yeah. You know, you don't, you want it to resemble where it came from. Mm -hmm. So these are examples here. Um, I have chicken salad and lettuce wraps. Ooh. You can see the chicken, you can see celery, grapes, and obviously you see the lettuce as opposed to like a, um, a traditional wrap that's a very processed food. Yeah, it looks you know? amazing. And then I noticed over here on the left, you have some avocado yep. with some, is it tuna? Yeah, you can make tuna salad and you can stuff it right in an avocado. So you got a lot of good fat going on. And this is all stuff, I mean, you can get this from the grocery store, right? right? And I it's mean, quick, right? How fast does it take to open up an avocado, yeah. stir up some tuna? I use some nice mayonnaise. I use avocado mayonnaise. Any kind of brand is fine, but it's better for your body to have a good healthy wow. fat like that. Love it, love yep. it. But I, I know it does not replace the need for exercise. And I know you also encourage that right. pretty seriously Absolutely. As well. Yep. Drinking water, exercise is all part of a clean, healthy diet very, and lifestyle. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. I'm going to try this right now. Let's see Absolutely. what it's all about. Absolutely. Yep. Oh, wow. It really is good. Right. I'm impressed. It's I don't think I would like it. I really do like it. Excellent. Very, very important reminders for folks out there to eat clean eat in this clean. new year. All That's right. right. We're, we're going to post the details about all of this on our website at wxyg.com. And thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. We'll take a quick break.